Hey there, welcome to the lesson. Uh, we're going to get back to the helping friendly look here and uh, take a look at how to play the lead parts in Dirt, or at least a couple of them. And this was requested by Sean, who's a supporter over on Patreon. And I, uh, I really appreciate it, Sean. So um, thanks for the suggestion and we'll uh, jump into it here. So we've got kind of that main uh, melody that Trey plays. So uh, here we go, starting on 7th fret of G with the pointer finger, and then we're going to hop up to B string right after that on the 10th fret. It's going to be almost the same thing, but a slight variance in it. Then we're going to have this pull off like that. We go to open low E. So for that lick, it's kind of just a uh, mostly a uh, E minor pentatonic kind of thing. Um, uh, so we have open E, then a, a hammer on from one to two on the A string, open D. 2nd fret, open G, now 2nd fret, just a slide up to 4, and then open G, D, 2nd fret, open G, 3rd fret of B, then a, a, it sounds like he goes to 5th fret, and then slides up to 7 um, on the B string to lead us back into um, the, the main chord progression. And then right there, um, we're gonna go D, and this is where it's like more of like the bass lead part, doing the same kind of melody we were doing up here. Um, but we're gonna play a D, A minor, and he might be playing an A minor seven. Um, then a C, and then he goes to a G, and it sounds like he's doing this kind of like top uh, half of a bar chord. If you look at a G bar chord like that, it's a. Uh, like, like that. So we've got four on G, three barred on B and E, and then on the, the album version at least, it sounds like he does this cool little slide up on 10th fret of E to 12 and back down to 10. And then same thing, D, A minor, C, G, D, A minor, C and G. And on the last one, we go to our G. Like that, the slide from 10 to 12, and then um, a bar on the 12th fret of G and B with uh, with the pointer finger, at least I think that's what's going on. Uh, we go... Like that. Um, because the chords that are behind this little uh, melody are E minor and then C. So we've got uh, E minor, C, and then it leads us into this kind of tricky... Um, uh, ar uh, arpeggio situation where we're doing a lot of fast picking. So all the way up here, we're going to have open D and go from there.
So uh, there you go. Um, uh, right after that, yeah, we go back to the main melody and then do it an octave up and then that is a wrap on that one and uh hope hope it helped um it's a really cool part that um maybe seems a little easier than it really is um and definitely worth practicing so uh thanks so much and uh, if you guys have any other ideas for specific um stuff you want covered like just a you know minute or two of a song for these helping friendly look uh videos let me know leave a comment um and i'll see you soon thanks